Good morning, YouTube. It's your guy, Kent Hollywood Matzinger. We are back at it, getting ready for another toy hunt video. We're at uh, Walmart today. Remember, as we go on our toy hunt, if you don't see something in your area, go ahead and uh, check out Big Bad Toy Store. Link in the description. Uh, Pre-order, get, uh, get those things sent directly uh, to your house. Check out Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description. We are still working on that 10K in 2022. So uh, definitely help us out, subscribe to the channel, all kinds of videos, Marvel Legends, G.I. Joe Classified series, Little Valverse, Action Force, Mythic Legions, all kinds of things going on here in uh, the Camp Pool Live. So uh, consider subscribing to the channel today. Toy hunt video, here we go. Main toy aisle, we got our little Hot Wheels dump here. There's another uh, Batmobile. Definitely some cool, nice little skull car there. All kinds of uh, different uh, singles this morning. Little color shifters. Ah, oh, check that out. A uh, little X Men for you. Black Wing. That's pretty cool. More color shifters. There's our little super rigs. Got uh, some different matchbox there. Little tech decks mixed in. A monster jams for you this morning. I feel like I've seen this at, uh, well, maybe it's been Walmart too, but uh, definitely at Target. Got a little Batman there. NAS cars. <laughs> Disney. Got some more DC vehicles. Little stars and stripes going on. Paw Patrol. All kinds of different cars this morning. Got uh Check those out. That's pretty cool. Fast and Furious. Uh, some different RC stuff. A little bit of Nerf. Alright, what we got? A little Easy Baker. Yum, right? Dinosaurs. Uh, most of these are older dinosaurs. Doesn't look like any, uh, there's like one new Dominion. Look at that, got the chip, your dinosaur. Oh, G.I. Joe classified there. Marvel Legends, looks like Doctor Strange wave there. Got some uh, different basic figures. Check out a uh, little Doctor Doom there. Monster Hunters. Okay. Maybe he's got almost like the Eye of Agamanu. There's a Captain America there. So some different uh, options with your basic figures. Got some mini figs as well. Little Batman there. Oh, Dr. Fate. What else we got? Uh, there is a little Legacy kickback. Ace. Oop. What else we got here? Drag strip. Huh. Nice. A couple more. Kingdom. 
So uh, yeah, boxes, a little bit of a window. No plastic boxes. <laughs> Good old Hasbro. There's our Power Rangers. I was interested to see. So you got tape there. You got this little pull thing. So yeah, gonna be interesting when we get to our boxes. There's another Legacy Transformer. Soundwave. There's our Megazord. Optimus Primal. Omegatron there. So yeah, got a few Transformers this morning. Got Turbo Man. Got uh, Bubba Fett. Olea there. A bunch of basic figures. Three and three quarter inch, couple Mandalorian, Landos, Masters of the Universe, Skeletor, Skele God, got uh, some of the classics going on, the powered up He Man, Avatar. There's some more little Marvel, like Captain America there and uh, Iron Man. All kinds of uh, mixed stuff. It's like a Battle Cat. It's kind of relaxing there. Got some Pokemon cards. Look at all the Pokemon cards. Some Master Chief, a little Halo down there as well. But yeah, it's a lot of cards. Fortnite, got some three and three quarter inch figures. There's our six inch figures. Right in there, Hasbro. What else we, oh, look at this. It's Mr. Brody Lee. And look at that uh, TNT title. That's pretty cool. Nice, who else we got? John Silver. There's another Brody Lee. Anna J. So uh, some of the Dark Order figures hitting uh, Walmart. Got a couple Power Rangers that uh, passed by. A uh, little black, pink, yellow. Let's see who else do we got? Little Nick Jackson, Archer. So some young bucks. That's cool though. Mr. Brody Lee. Is that another? Yeah. Here is Stu Grayson. Dark Order. So uh, pretty cool. Seeing a little bit of uh, newer wrestlers. Got some Pixar, about uh, a little light year going on. A little buzz, a little buzz. Oh yeah, all kinds of buzzes. <laughs> so we got the three different variants on Buzz Lightyear. Some Piggy. There's some normal Buzz Lightyear. Then we got that uh, figure there and uh, Woody. All right, let's go uh, check out the little Funko closet and we'll see if there's anything new there today. We got this morning, little Pan's Labyrinth. Got uh, Gremlins thing, Annabelle, more Dr. Fate. Uh, got a Superman there. And another Dr. Fate. A little best action this morning. Aang. A couple other anime figures there. Jackie Robinson. A little bit of Funko Gold going on. Gremlins, Le Gizmo. A My Hero plushie. Larry Bird hanging out in the uh, Funko closet there i think i saw a little bit yeah there's a couple pops out this way let's see what we got a little bit of star wars 
a little bit of Marvel, Squid Games, got uh, Player One there, how about uh, Masked Manager, Player 199, and 465, Round Masked Worker, so yeah, check out those uh, Squid Game Pops. And uh, I think that's gonna do it for this Walmart. All finished up at Walmart. Uh, some basic figures, AEW, we were just uh, missing that evil Uno, but uh, yeah, that, uh, that wave's pretty cool. The Dark Order, uh, who would think you could just, uh, here's your wave, it's a faction. So that's, uh, that's a pretty cool way to uh, knock out a wave from AEW. Got those uh, Buzz Lightyear or just Lightyear toys coming out. So it'll be interesting to see as our prices get adjusted. Uh, are those basic figures going to keep rising in price? Are they going to become the new like $20 <laughs> figures? Uh, whew, it's going to be an interesting uh, 23 yeah, finishing up 22 and into 23 and seeing kind of where toys go. Just uh, so many weird things happening. And uh, as long as people are going out and buying and uh, buying on that secondary market, uh, it's hard to, uh, hard to tell these toy companies no, but a lot of money being spent on plastic and until it slows down or stops we'll probably keep seeing price increases but uh enough whining about plastic let's get back to the garage we got more mythic legion figures got another uh lot in so uh let's go check it out let's go play Let's go see some Mythic Legions. YouTube, I know what you're thinking. That's a, that's a box on a Greg Cook diorama. But uh, look at this. More Mythic Legions. We got more figures. Check out that uh, big old box there. Uh, we're going to get inside and uh, see what we got today. And uh, hopefully y'all enjoy this video. Uh, gonna see if we can't just kind of open them up and set them up on the diorama piece. Uh, I want to thank my guy Jared from uh, the Pence Pack. Was uh, able to... Hook me up with all these Mythic Legions. Give me great deal on these figures. So let's do this. Let's pull these over to the side. And uh, let's dig in and see what we can find first in our box. All kinds of bubble wrap. And we got us nice little shadow inquisitor quizzing on that guy is uh orc or not orc uh ogre scale big old boy definitely a cool cool piece dig in what we got have to dig through. Uh, I'm sure there's weapons and stuff. So probably uh, first sight of things is just going to be our different figures. We got uh, some more blood armor. How cool is that? A uh, little customized cape. That's not the original cape. We do have uh, the sword there. Pretty cool sword. Taking a nap on us? What's going on there? 
Put all uh, blood armor, we'll put the sword there. Let me know in the comments uh, if you are collecting Mythic Legions, just getting started or been doing it for a while. Uh, let me know what figures you're collecting, what figures you are after. You're gonna see some different figures today. Got uh, little war hammers, a couple different war hammers. Check out this guy, this guy is awesome. Little uh, goblin, yeah, little goblin king. Got like his little crown and everything. Got his little cape looking all, look at that guy. And we got, got us an orc. That is pretty cool. Other goblins, so gonna have some different goblins, some different orcs. Nice little hammer there. Check this bad guy out. Look at that. Little mace action for you. Not mace windu, but it's a mace. So yeah, some different pieces there. Let's see. like another goblin it's kind of cool got like the little teeth there this guy he's got himself a little bit of a smile there some horns got a big old spear another mace but a crossbow, a little crossbow action there. That's cool. All kinds of different. Check out this guy. Goblin time. So I did uh, open these up, just uh, kind of inspect them, make sure, you know, everything was together. Everything was packaged awesome. So wasn't uh, worried about it, but you know, just wanted to make sure everything came okay. But yeah, let's, that looks like a lot of our kind of similar characters. So yeah, you got that uh, little goblin king, which is cool. There's our orc these goblins uh you know a lot of fun with their size and uh you can see how they kind of compare that is so cool let me know in the comments what are you after what do you think of these goblins our uh, second blood armor there and our second uh little shadow Aquarian, pretty crazy, huh? Four horsemen. We have uh, reset up and uh, cleared out all of those uh, goblins and the blood armor, and uh, we got a couple that came in boxes: uh, the dragul and uh, silver chord. Pretty cool. Got uh, the wings and definitely a cool little piece there. Another uh, little vampire. We uh, we already have the, uh, he's uh, Masters of the Universe. A uh, little throwback inspiration for uh, Hordak, which we already have in the collection. So uh, stay tuned to see what we do with uh with those figures but we got more from the box so let's get back to it some more bubble wrap tried to uh get these started so maybe it would be a little easier and uh y'all wouldn't have to deal with all the noise and everything 
But yeah, this guy is uh, crazy cool. Look at, uh, yeah, this guy is a mean little dude. Got the uh, tail and we got the wings. So that is gonna be a fun little demon or maybe something else. Definitely uh, stay tuned. Uh, always uh, thinking about what to do with these figures. Maybe uh, make them a little different. Here is our demo. Painful unboxing, right? Little uh, skeleton guy here. Yeah, got the shield, got the mace. Real cool. Little uh, green skeleton. Which we also have in the collection. So seeing a couple of duplicates, but like I said, maybe some different fun things with our characters. Maybe some custom paint. Maybe uh, switch out some parts. There is Tibulus. Looks good. Uh, cape looks a lot better than <laughs> what I do with the capes. But yeah, that's, a, that's an awesome skeleton. I, uh, I added the the extra arms to our original and uh, that makes for a fun different looking skeleton right another skeleton that's uh we have like i said these uh could be parts for uh customs try to make them into other characters but there is Mollus. He is a uh, pretty sinister. Definitely want to look out for that guy. So a little demon, couple skeletons. What do we got next? Do we want to see? How about something a little different? Hopefully I got enough room for this guy. I don't know if I set up the camera. Hopefully it's tall enough. But how about a little, uh, little Cyclops action there? How cool is that piece? I'll have to, I'll do some pictures later, kind of show you the scale, the size, but that is a orc level. Look at that. Woo! That is a long X. Very cool piece. Definitely was excited to add that and we got a few more pieces this one uh, is an interesting piece if i can yeah open them up a little farther definitely an excellent job with uh, the bubble wrap definitely taking very good care Picking up part of the diorama. So let's see, can I get this guy out? He's, uh, he's in there pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Let me try something else. Definitely uh, let me know if you're enjoying or if you have any suggestions. Like, do you want to just see pictures of figures? Should I do less? figures in uh in these videos is it uh is it taking too long to reveal all these characters definitely let me know in the comments i'm definitely having a lot of fun with uh with the mythic legions and uh of course i am terrible with the names so i apologize Definitely go check out uh, the Four Horsemen's website. 
Uh, they have a checklist with uh, all the characters and uh, their different like background stories and pictures so you can see all of the items and different things that uh, come with the figures. But uh, check this guy out. It's a little, uh, yeah, Krampus. Well, holiday, uh, got the basket, steal him uh, some children. How crazy is that? That is a uh, scary, scary piece. He might go well with uh, with our werewolf, right? Did, uh, did y'all see the NECA werewolf video that we did? All right, this guy's cool. This is one of the first uh, knights that uh, I've actually picked up. Let's see if... Man, I thought I had these like ready to go, but they are in the package pretty good. There we go. All right, this guy is cool. Look at that guy. How cool is that? Got the, like, the, little, the helmet rises up. Got uh, the soft good. Look at the soft good on this guy. How awesome is that? The red, the black. Uh, you got like the lion. So very cool piece. Very cool piece. Uh, that could be another rabbit hole if uh, if I start picking up some more. Uh, like human type characters so far we've uh <laughs> we've been kind of skeletons and vampires now i'm getting like demons and cyclops uh <laughs> do i do i start adding humans and the uh, knight templars and how about uh how about an elf <laughs> Do I start adding elves? How sweet is that? The armor, and again, the soft goods, just uh, kind of blend, go well together. So that is a pretty cool piece. And let me show you. This is a really cool piece, uh, part of my uh, wanting to scoop up this collection found this guy and definitely different but uh this custom painted round um round shield knight so it actually has the paint details of uh the vampires so how cool is that kind of painted up and joining the vampire legion so I definitely love the look of the knights, but for him to have uh, the paint and the detail where he can fit into the brood definitely uh, made me want to pick that figure up. But uh, let me know in the comments, what do you think of all these mythic legions? Here, let me go. Maybe uh, give you a little... Yeah, what do you think of all these different figures in the comments? Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Check out uh, the big guy of uh, the collection, this lot, uh, Brondis. What an uh, awesome, awesome figure. He actually was uh, the reason why I ended up buying the uh, lot. Uh, originally, I was just trying to get my hands on him and uh, found some other great pieces along with him. And, uh, you know, here we go. Buy <laughs> another collection. But uh, he's got, like, the skull of a another troll. Uh, the gold chain's pretty cool. He is a uh, house of, like, the noble bear. So he was kind of, like, enslaved and fighting gladiator-type fights. And uh, now one of the heroes of... Uh, mythic legions but let me know in the comments uh what do you think uh, we got a little bit of a crew here some of uh, my favorites from 
the collection we just picked up. Uh, do you want to buy some Mythic Legions? I might have some <laughs> Mythic Legions for sale. Uh, definitely been selling, trading, doing some different things uh, to pick up more figures. And, you know, that's part of the fun of collecting is uh, kind of taking different items and uh, getting different items. So some people might not have had something in their collection and being able to trade and get something. So definitely part of the collecting but i hope you enjoyed this video smash that like button check out the link in the description big bad toy store uh if you're looking for things in your area and uh just can't find them it might be worth checking big bad toy store get things pre-ordered get things shipped out and uh you know don't have to run all over the place looking for them, but link in the description. Check out BitBad Toy Store. If you haven't already, jump into the Kent Pool Live. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube, also over on Instagram at Kent Pool Live. Thank you, thank you to all of the subscribers to the channel. And thank you to our channel members. Until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting.